I'm building my dream house right here in Jamaica and I'm taking it from this to this with 1.5 million dollars. Thank you God in advance for glory. I thank you God in advance for breakthrough. I thank you God in advance for healing. I thank you God. Last you saw us we were digging the foundation and this is just a clip showing up close of them digging the foundation and then they did the tying of the steel and laying the foundation. Now let's get on to the other part where they will be casting the foundation. I think that is the proper term. Let's let me show you up close what the steel looks like inside of the foundation. I don't know if the terms are correct, but bear with me. May I beg on you, please? So the casting of the foundation is a whole day work and it takes a lot of manpower. Guys came in from about 6, 7 o'clock in the morning and they didn't leave until the same time at night. So 12 hours, 10 guys, and they actually laid the steel pour the mortar, mix the mortar, pour it into the, the foundation and that is what you'll be seeing most of today. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to stress this point very much. Living in a building while it is being worked on, especially with children, it is very difficult. There's a lot of dust, a lot of dirt, and it is really difficult. Everything just dirty and disgusting. But we just have to bear with it because we do not have any other choice. We don't have any relatives that we can stay with, so we just have to bear with it. So this is the guys actually making the matter. I actually hung up some plastics on the veranda to try and keep out some of the splatter of the tile on the veranda and just try to keep the place as clean as possible. We lock all windows and doors while they were here doing that just to ensure that we keep the place clean. The things are going on here. I don't know, good. Morning. Okay, so this is the following morning after they have done um, basically finished laying the foundation and this is basically the first time I can actually see clearly my vision being executed. I stand here and I cry a little bit because we have been through so much as a family. We have been through a lot. So to be able to be here to be in this space to see where we are at right now, trust me, it is truly, truly, truly nothing short of a miracle. So I cried a little. I'm not going to lie. I cried a little. When I look at it, I can actually see where my room is going to be. I can see where my bathroom will be, where my closet will be. This, the, not, this, not the, just the staircase, but the back veranda, the pantry area, the kitchen, and then of course the passage run along the middle there. I can finally see it and it is so beautiful. I think this might just be the most beautiful thing I have ever seen in my entire life. Trust me, I feel so proud of us, proud of my husband, proud of myself because we have wanted to do this for a very long time one of my friends actually told me you know what use every money that you have instead of just bringing up the the one side that you need need right now use the money that you have and take everything out the foundation and then you're gonna work on the room that you actually need right now and i'm so glad that i 
took that advice and that is what is important about um on a journey like this it's always good to you know take counsel from persons who are wise and, I'm, and I, I am saying wise because you can't just take advice from everybody but they gave me really good advice where this is concerned and i'm really glad that we did that so we took everything out the foundation and then we're just gonna work on the one side that we need which is the room and the bathroom and then in the future why whatever money leave back then we will work on the other side because as we said it is not dire right now i'm not the lulu so i know the 1.5 will not be able to do everything so we're gonna do as much as we possibly can make it livable and then we are gonna move on to the other side so stay tuned for that right so this is how far we got is it beautiful isn't she lovely isn't she lovely my people my people my people god uh, big up god big up you all the time <laughs> see the little boy crab it you could send on what time what time now Alright, so my phone crashed and I lost a lot of the footage, but this is basically where we are at presently. So they actually, they're bringing up this side. As I said, we're only bringing up one side. So we're bringing up the bathroom and the bedroom, which is going to be our main bathroom, our bedroom, which is, our people call it master bathroom or master bed. So this is for me and my husband's room. Um, the, the scheme that we live in, the, the units actually come with two bedrooms and we all have been sharing that two bedroom and a bathroom so we have outgrown the space and it is time for us to get our own little quarter so we're doing our own um main bedroom with an ensuite bathroom and closet so that is what we're doing right now so as you can see this is where the guys actually reach right now present day and then um you will see a little bit further coming next week <laughs> hopefully so stay tuned for that for <laughs> i am actually showing fake showing as i said it's like you can actually finally see the vision of exactly where everything is going to be and when i stand in that space i can actually say okay so this is where my toilet is going to be this is where my face basin will be this is where my shower will be it feels really good as i said feels really good i feel like an adult i feel grown up i feel mature me a big woman can't talk to me it feels just as good as when they handed me my first child and say this is your baby you know i feel really good really accomplished so big up me big up god big up my husband big up my family big up all my support system and uh, thank you so much for watching see you next week for more video and remember to like share and subscribe i need you guys to subscribe and i need you guys to like the video interact ask questions in the comment section or whatever else because you are going to help to drive traffic and hopefully help us to finish this place this dream house this dream mansion that we're planning to complete this is the morgan's legacy if you're new here please share your name has so we can become more acquainted and be family okay okay god bless you all what good mm -hmm.